Oh, hello. This is Tom from anti-proton.com. I wanted to tell you about SC International. Um, I don't talk about a product unless I like a product. Because I don't sell products and I don't get anything for it. Which is unfortunate, because I should get something for it because I'm talking about it, but I don't. But regardless, I did get something I did like, and that's this, my Inspector EXP Geiger counter. Let me tell you about a good customer experience. Most people talk about bad customer experiences. You know, somebody screwed me over, they didn't do what they were supposed to do, something got broken. Well, very few people talk to you about good customer experiences, and I want to talk to you about a good one. I bought this Geiger counter, um, let's see what the original date was. July 20th of this year, I got this Geiger counter from GeigerCounters.com. And, of course, it comes from SC International. SCINT.com, I believe. Well, I've been using it for a while because it is, what, eight times more sensitive, three times, depending on what you're, sa what you're sampling, than my other Geiger counters. That means, like, incredibly sensitive. See? Yeah, very sensitive. Where my old Geiger counter got... 50, 60 counts per minute off of a bag of potassium salt, this gets 500. I mean, that gives you an idea right there. Now, <clears throat> I was happy with it. I loved it. It was doing everything great until one day, in fact, with this very piece of depression glass. I had it sitting on the table, and I came down to scan it, and instead of getting 50, 60, 100 counts per minute, all of a sudden, the Geiger counter shot up to 350,000 counts per minute. I nearly wet myself. The reason, of course, was there was something wrong with the Geiger counter. Because even if this were a bar of uranium, it might not... Well, I don't know. Bar of uranium might probably not, though. It's hard to say. It depends on various factors. But the point of the matter is that, that that's a hell of a lot of radiation to pick up. So, you know, I'm taking the Geiger counter... And every time I put it near it, it goes crazy. I moved it over and did it in a different place, same thing. And that was, that was when it occurred to me there was something wrong. I didn't know what was wrong, and I was really upset. Brand new Geiger counter, what the hell am I supposed to do? Is the tube warrantied? What's going to happen? The thing has like a two-year warranty, but the tube warranty is not as long. I was, like, devastated. So I called up, uh, let me cut the sound off. I, cut up, I called up SC International on the phone, and I said... Come on, man, what am I supposed to do? My Geiger counter's damaged. It's going crazy. Oh, my God. They said, don't worry about it. And they gave me a UPS number, and they told, told me to ship it to them, and they, they would expedite it, throw it to the front of the line, because, you know, it's like I just got the new, the new thing. It's not like I've had it for years and it broke. It's brand new. This shouldn't be happening. The measure of a company is not when everything works well. It's when it doesn't work. Yeah, everybody sells products. A lot of them could be good for years. Even a crappy product could be good for years. But when they break, it's how they deal with it. I went to the UPS store, dropped the Geiger counter in a box, wrote up the information, like where I, you know, my address and everything, gave, gave them the UPS uh, number that I was given by the, the SE International people. They took it, shipped it right out, super duper fast to SE. SE got it on the phone, they called me back, you know, they said, the problem is not your Geiger counter, it's your cable. We'll fix it, of course. All taken care of. I found out, by the way, the tube, tube warranty was longer than I thought. Then I got a call the next day. They said, sorry for your inconvenience. Could we offer you a free calibration? And not like an electronic calibration, a real source calibration. Would you like one? Just for the hell of it. Sure. Why not? That, that's great. So they, they calibrated it for me. They sent it back. It's in great working order, not a single problem in the world. I'm quite happy with them. Um, first off, they calibrated my unit, and the, the, both of them here, as you can see, there's little stickers on them that say, like uh, uh, what the calibration uh, settings were. The reading at 50 millirems per hour, uh, uh, actually it's not millirems, it's actually millirenkins. I know they're approximately the same, but not technically. So 50 millirenkins, 5 millirenkins, 0.5 millirenkins. Calibration factors that need to be changed, everything about them. They also sent me the cer certificate here. I like my certificate. Damn. There's a truckload of information on this. I mean a truckload of information on this. This is great. It gives me all the readings. It says, um, precision consistency check performed with CS137 source serial number. And they have a serial number for the source. Uh, reading 1, reading 2, reading 3, the mean reading. 
the plus or minus of what it came out to, how much of it they used, the exact date, all the times, and everything that go along with it. This is awesome. They even told me like my 9 volt battery is producing 9.38 volts DC. That's awesome. So, as a result of that, I am very pleased. I like when things get taken care of. GeigerCounters.com was good, SC International was good. They took care of me in, 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 in a jiffy too. Especially when they're still getting, you know, so overburdened with all the people right now buying Geiger counters like crazy. So, I'm very happy about that, and I wanted to take the time to say that. I still say that buying from SC International, and of course you don't usually buy straight from them, you usually buy through somebody else, like GeigerCounters.com is a good example. I say they're a good company. I've also had good dealings, by the way, with uh, International Medcom, too, so not to knock them either. In fact, both of them are on my list of people to buy Geiger counters from. But so far, the best experience I've had is Geiger, GeigerCounters.com and SC International. So I'm a satisfied customer, being satisfied. Here I am being satisfied with my Geiger counter. So this is Tom from AntiProton.com, and bye-bye.